One of the big questions, and it's been asked repeatedly, is whether or not the president will attack Syria even if Congress votes down the resolution authorizing the use of force. I want to play how Deputy National Security Advisor Tony Blinken answered that this week and then what President Obama said in Russia. Take a look. The president, of course, has the authority uh, to act, but it's neither his desire nor his intention to, do, to use that authority uh, absent Congress uh, backing him. I did not put this before Congress. Um, you know, just as a political point uh, or as symbolism. Uh, I think it is important for us to have a serious debate in the United States uh, about, uh, about these issues. It sure sounds like the president is going to abide by what Congress decides. Why not just say that and make, this, make it clear what the stakes are here? Congress, it's in your hands whether we act re or not. Why not put it on Congress? Well, as the president said, uh, this is not an empty ex exercise. We are expending a great amount of energy and uh, investment in trying to make sure that Congress understands. If you, if you and, say no, and what I'll we, live with it. What the president has said throughout the course of this is that uh, if Congress wants to make sure that there's consequence for a dictator using this dastardly weapon against his own people, including children, then they're going to have to vote yes for this resolution.